east side Madison neighborhood was awakened today after a high speed chase ended on their street. For the aftermath of that, we go to Lauren Winfrey live with an update. Hi, Lauren. Christine, good morning. Well, this community is certainly waking up, and I'm live on the corner of Hayes Road and Anniversary. Uh, and if I step out of the way here, you can see all of the intersections. Well, it's completely blocked off, and it's been this way since uh, earlier this morning following a high-speed high speed chase that ended in a crash right in front of this Perkins restaurant. And the sun is rising now, but when we arrived here a little after 3 this morning, it was dark, and there were several officers from the Dane County Sheriff's Office all assessing the aftermath of this crash and the front of the vehicle is what appears to have the most damage. Now I'm told the driver of the vehicle is male. He's injured, but we do not know to what extent just yet. And he was taken to an area hospital. I spoke with the sheriff's deputy and he says he first spotted the SUV near 151 in Milwaukee. He tried to pull the driver over for not having plates. And that's when the chase started because that driver, he refused to pull over. And according to the Dane County dispatch, that SUV did exceed 100 miles per hour during the pursuit. And the sheriff's deputy I spoke with, well, he did say that they will release more information a little later this morning. For now, uh, this road continues to be blocked off and we have no word on when it will reopen. Live in Madison, Lauren Winfrey, NBC 15 News.